God forgive me, or yesterday was Independence Day. It might be no, I forgot because we had this World Championship. So we just, I was just focused. First of October, oh my God, I have hit, 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 hit. I actually forgot it was anybody's birthday or anything. It might be no. It's even my birthday month, but it's all right, sure. Happy birthday in advance. Thank you. It's 17th of October, so if you want to send me wishes, you're welcome. <laughs> I am that you just competed in the semi finals. Yeah. You finished fifth. Yeah, yeah, to be honest, like I wanted to do something better, of course, because this is a semi finals, world championship, everybody is so fast. So I started out fast and I was happy I was in the group till a certain while. So today, I'm kind of happy because even though I didn't make the final, I actually finished with the realization of, oh, I've done a good job to get here, but I still have more work to put in because I just felt like I was missing something because that getting to the hurdle I was like slower than the rest so I just felt like I could just get faster you know it's all about getting faster 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 so yeah I have work to do but I'm really happy because I still did this Olympic final twice so somebody told me because I actually haven't realized so even though I still have work to do I'm happy I confirmed I am an Olympic athlete if you can say that way so it really gives me a lot of confidence and um, yeah, joy, and I'm ready to take on the challenge by God's grace. So yeah, let's get this. <laughs> Do you think there's anything you could have done differently? Oh, I mean, no, because I feel what the way I am now, what I've done, I did it to the best of my ability. Like mentally, I was there. I was just really focused. I was like, you have nothing to lose. Just go there and run just run so that was what was in my head i didn't want to um i wasn't keeping holding anything back so what i just felt was like something was missing and that's all part of growing stages i still need to get through so that's that's what i just feel and my coach is so happy it was like we've got to the semi-final it was not it wasn't obvious so anything we have extra is just like a blessing so i really feel blessed because this this is this is hard work but it's really rewarding <laughs> Um, tell us a bit about your schooling. You were at the World University Games this year, and I hear you're a medical student. Can you tell us a bit about that and how you've been uh, able to merge it with your athletics career? Honestly, I don't know. It's God, though. <laughs> it's God. Like, for real, I am 100% honest because I'm a medical student. It is hard work because if, medical, if I have some medical students that you know, they don't give us small books, they give us these books, and that's like one exam. So, but I, it's, it's my passion, it's something I'm passionate about. I mean, the doctors there, just look at them as superhumans, but they don't actually understand, they're not really superhumans. You know, they, they study, they go through stages and hard work too. So to be honest, I find a lot of parallels between what I'm doing, like outside the track, and what I'm doing in the track. And even though it's like, it's hard work, but it's rewarding, and I wouldn't want it anywhere, any, anyhow else. So um, it takes a lot of energy, it takes a lot of grace, it takes a lot of support. I mean, I wouldn't be where I am without my support group. So I thank my parents, I thank my friends, I thank my coaches, my dream team. They've really been there for me, even when I was out of it. <laughs> but yeah, it really takes the grace of God and a uh, lot of determination. Like you really need to love it because if you don't love it, just drop it. <laughs> like <laughs> really. <laughs> so yeah. So I am mean, you've been in Italy since you were a little child, but the yeah. Nigerian influence is still very oh, strong. Tell God. us what. <laughs> So I was born in Nigeria, I grew up in Nigeria, my parents had Nigerian parents, Yoruba Nigerian parents, my mom Ekiti, my dad Ondo, there is no mistake in it. So I have a lot of um, relatives abroad, so I'm still going back to Nigeria to, you know, to grow up and everything. So. I feel I'm trying to like be the best of both worlds if it's possible. So I mean that Nigerian will still be in me. But I really love the European influence, growing up in an Italian in Italian culture, it kind of broadens my horizon. And some things it's just unfortunate because I live in Europe and I really want to represent Nigeria the best I can because you know immigrants, you know, black people are always looked at as you know, you always have a special focus and attention and I'm trying to do the best as I can to turn it into a positive light. It just saddens my heart at times because when I'm in Italy, I just usually have the bad news, you know, about Nigeria down. Oh, you're making it. I mean, I'm sure there are a lot of good people out there doing great things, but why is the only Wahala we always here? Please now, please do something. I mean, I can't jump into Nigeria and come and do this, but I can do my own here. Please do your own at home, please. Uh, you know, anyway, we are blessed. You know, Nigeria, we know they carry last now. So let's come on, let's do it. I mean, like, this season is over. What ah. is next for you? And oh, I still have the 4x4 relay, so you know, we still need to 
carry the body together. <laughs> so, but that's always fun. That's always fun. And come uh, we we'll see us through, you know, as usual. And I still have. I just look at it as another moment to, you know, to still have fun and put my best out there. And then finally, to be off season. Really, I can't wait. This season has been so long. God knows it has been long. <laughs> so I really can't wait to rest, relax. And then I can't relax too much because I have to start university. I mean, they started without me, but I can't do anything at the World Championship, so I'm excused. But yeah, resume with my life, you know, get back into the usual thing. Oh, yeah, it's good, it's good. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Mwah.